This 2.5 km road stretching from Palabeki to Lamo Town Council is among those facilities which have been commissioned by Lands Minister Judith Nabakova during her visit to northern Uganda. Allow me to appreciate the people who offered this land. If you want money, why don't you do business? You don't, don't mix the two. Don't do government job at the same time. In company of Minister for Relief, Disaster Preparedness and Refugees Hilary Onek, Nabakoba Commissioned Lamo Resource Centre and Lagot Opok Palabek Central Market, all constructed under the USMID project. We pray that whatever has been put in place by government will be maintained because projects come and go. USMID is ending on 30th June, but you have a sustainability plan for maintaining what has been put in place by government. The handover of motorcycles to local leaders is one of the moments which lit up the day. The handover ceremony of freehold land certificate to over 500 beneficiaries climaxed the day's event. The titles we are getting, they are freehold titles. And freehold titles as refugee host communities. It means that you are holding that land in perpetuity forever. It is your title. You are beginning a generation of land owners. People who have titles forever and ever. According to the minister, with the available resources and facilities, Lamo communities have nothing to complain about. Because these are 50 stones. You expected more than this. What happened? find out what happened if you expected more and this is what we are seeing. The 518 freehold land titles have been secured under the systematic land adjudication and certification slack whereas the road market and resource center are all world bank led project under USMID. Sada Mubale, Robert Onyango, UBC News. Yeah.